How's it going guys? I'm here with Tim Chapman, Aero Antennas. We're gonna take a look at what you got here at Hamvention. Cool stuff, stay tuned. So hey Tim, I am a user of your antennas. I've got a bunch of your products, but you've got a cool little booth here. Why don't you talk about what you, what you have today and maybe what you're working on coming out with that's new and interesting. Certainly can do that. All right. Uh, our antennas cover six meters through 440, mm -hmm. and we uh, offer handheld antennas like this. We have uh, antennas that would mount on a uh, mast at your house, on a tower. Is that like a J-pole, that particular up J -pole one? This open-stub J-pole in particular is uh, for two meters and 440. Awesome. This is the split flavor that would go in a go kit. So okay. The kind that you'd mount on a uh, tower at home would be like this. Oh, right. Okay. Got it. Makes sense. A lot, so that's actually your portable J pole, if the, you will. The yellow top, yeah. And then we have ground plane antennas and uh, handheld antennas for all of those same bands. Mm -hmm. Our satellite antennas are our most popular little fellas. So These can, are very well known in the satellite community. That's what I use myself. Yeah, a handheld and one of those and you're good to go. We also offer corner reflectors which aren't showing here. We have Yagi's for six meters also which aren't showing here. Okay. And uh, Fox Hunt offset attenuator, Fox Hunt loop, you two, two meter portable for fox hunting. And lastly, uh, our uh, upcoming uh, teaser for next year is we're looking to have an Azel rotor for sale. Excellent. That'll is that be portable? Portable 12 volts for drone market for the drones and for ham radio. Using the products that you make that's yep. already on the market. So yep. you could create a fully controllable azimuth and elevation antenna yep. system. A, a, that's ground, a, awesome. ground, a ground station, if you will. Can you tell me, because I, I was curious about this. I got asked a couple of times. You have different links of some of your Yaggies. Why is that specifically? Different numbers. So if to understand our model numbers is the easiest way. Okay. This is a 146-3. Mm -hmm. So that's two meters, th three elements. And BP means backpack, like a split boom. Got it. So that it'll store in a smaller space. Perfect. So the different lengths are for the different numbers of elements on the different frequencies. Okay. 440 megahertz, seven elements. 440 megahertz, seven elements with a split boom. Okay. 220 megahertz, three elements. 440 megahertz, five elements. Got it. We also have a smaller one that has three elements. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's the basic idea. For, for the people that are doing summits on the air, we have the 52-1 BP for six meters. Oh, cool. And it's just a dipole and that it holds, is on a vertical mast. Oh, nice. And we're gonna put the rest of the holes that are needed in this mast so that a person can do two meters, 220, 440, all only carrying one mast, but all the extra elements. Oh, Save you a little weight when you're climbing. Now, is that something new? No, or? it's been around for a couple years. I didn't years. even know about this, yeah. okay. Little Fantastic. six meter dipole. Okay. Yeah, the soda people wanted something light, so we did it. Yeah. You've got the bag there as well. I've got mine in a, in a roll-up bag there. Yeah, we've got bags for the uh, satellite antennas that are a wrap bag that wrap mm -hmm. around all the parts and have pockets yeah. and Velcro shut. And then we have tube bags. They just drop all the pieces in the end of the tube and zip it shut. Fantastic. Yeah. Obviously, not everybody is here with us at Hamvention. So where do people find you and how do they get your products? Aeroantennas.com. And we are located in Cheyenne, but we don't have a showroom. Well, links will be in the description. Awesome. Thanks so much for, for talking with us. Well, thank you very Appreciate much for having it. me. All right. 